What's going on guys and welcome back to another hockey card opening with Coach Stoneface. Now today is going to be a good one because they finally came in. 2018-2019 Upper Deck Synergy Hobby Boxes. So in this we get 8 packs per box, 3 cards per pack. Um, you know we are expected to see a couple of good cards in this. I'm pretty excited. I'm a big Synergy fan. I've been doing some... 2020-2021 uh, live breaks with Synergy, so there is some good things coming here. I don't know if I'm going to open both in this video, but we are going to get through one, and I am extremely excited. Remember the last video we did all of the um, openings from uh, them from Presti Marketing. Apologize about the lethargicness in that video, but we are good to go. Um, definitely have some cool cool ones here. Uh, this Antoine Bebo, you gotta love Toronto market, is actually pretty valuable. I mean, I think it's like a $15 card on eBay right now, which is crazy. Um, Keith Blard, still not too bad. This Chris Letang one. But honestly, the, the most valuable card we ended up having last time. Let's see if I can find it here. These are all the cards from, from that one. Is actually this one. The Nick Pomari. And the most valuable one is actually the Frozen Fabrics here of P.K. Subin. So, you know, it, it's going for about 20 bucks online. Even the Zayden on Char is going pretty well. I don't know how this is going so expensive. I kind of just want to get in on it right now and throw it online, see if I can get some value. Um, looking at the comps for this one, I actually found a Corey Perry Frozen Fabrics from Upper Deck Ice. And I put a bid in on it, 99 cents, and I won the bid. So, um Pretty excited for that, but it also makes me feel like the PK Subin ones are not accurate in their value. But without further ado, we're going to open up our was this our second, third ever hobby box. So the first one was MVP, the second one was the victory, and now we're opening up our third ever hobby box, our first ever of Synergy. This is actually my first time opening Synergy myself. Besides going through the breaks, I've never actually opened Synergy. <clears throat> All right, so we are. Through there, we will pop this open here, see what it says. So, collect the Synergy Red Parallel base set, cast for greatness card. So, if you get the bounty cards, I know you can do this. I know I have quite a few bounty cards of this year's already, but we'll go through those here as soon as I start getting some more in the mail. It's pretty cool. So, we got eight packs with three cards per pack. So, I mean, obviously, there's not going to be a ton of cards. But it's still pretty cool. Let's see if I can get this to to pop open here without wrecking anything. Let's see if I'm able to do it. All right. What's catching? Something's catching. There we go. All right. So synergy. What can we get today? Hoping for something good. Not expecting a whole lot. Definitely just hoping. Hoping for something to pop open here. Let's see what we get. I guess I... Yeah, there are going to be some die cut ones. Um, didn't go through what what uh, the odds are. But I mean, if you know Synergy, you're going to have... The, the parallels are easier to find than the base packs. Let's see if it shows up there. Not very good. But I mean, you're looking at... Um, Base set and cast for greatness, veterans, you're gonna have legends, pretty much everything is serial numbered here. So we will hammer through these. Let's just get opening them and, and see what uh see what comes from it. But another pack that's hard to open. Okay. We'll go the the old school way here. Alright, pack number one. So we have a rookie right away. R Rourke or Chartier. So I'll put this down here. We've got a couple of rookies in this one, which is nice. It's actually a 3D card. I don't know if you can kind of see that. It's The ridge is right there. So it's a red parallel. This one is a bounty. So if you were one of the first ones to get this, you'd scratch this off and you'd put it in the system, which is nice. Man, I like Synergy. That's a cool looking card. Not a, not a great rookie, but a cool looking card. So then you have Spencer Fu. So this one. The blue parallels out of $7.99. Spencer Fu. And then we have a postseason perfection. 2003 Stanley Cup playoffs. Martin Brodeur. Brodeur logs record seventh career. Seventh, seven postseason shutouts. Wow. 
seven postseason shutouts. So postseason perfection. <clears throat> All right, there's box number one. We have one numbered card of Spencer Fu. Again, probably not the the sexiest name if you want to open up something, but we uh, we do like that. I still need to find a how people open these properly. Okay. So lots of rookies in these. So this is definitely changed from current years, but uh, Christian Vasilainen, rookie. We have exceptional talent. We are at a 749 here. So this one actually has four cards. This one's supposed to have three. So exceptional talent out of 749, same steel. Cool looking card. Another rookie here, Noel Juleson. This one is a green parallel, so out of 299. And then we have a significant selection. Connor McDavid, 2015 first round, first pick. All right. There's pack number two. <clears throat> Since I bought these, the store has started selling, ten, uh, selling these $10 more a pack. Crazy. It's absolutely crazy. I'm super excited for this, so I'm, I'm happy. Happy to finally be opening some synergy. I might go back. I might just offer them the same because on eBay, eBay you can offer um, when you have something in your cart, you can you can make an offer. So I might just go back at him and, and see if he's willing to to accept the same. All right. So here's our first one. We got a Peter Forsberg. That just looks like a base. Non-bounty. So non-bounty base. So with this one, the funny thing is, it's easier to grab um, a parallel or an insert than it is a base card. We have an uh, Andrei Svechnikov, Glow Shift. I'm not familiar with this insert, but it's not numbered or anything. And then we have a green pk suban another just base card i believe so the base set is 100 cards because one pack had four i am expecting at least one pack here to have two Dylan Dubé, rookie. A Jarrett Anderson Dolan, rookie green. So 100 out of 299. And a significant selection. Let's see if I can say this right this time. Yes, Barry Kotkaniemi. There we go. So that would be the first first stack there. Now we're moving into our second stack of the break. All right. Don't know. I don't. I'm pretty excited. A couple couple limited cards here. And I'm just. I've been looking on Beckett before this. I mean, there's not a ton of value unless we can get an auto um, or one of their their class one rookies, which is out of 99. There's not a lot of value to this this product, but I'm, I'm pretty excited with what we're getting. So we have a Nathan McKinnon. All right. I think this is one um, that has some value. So significant selections. Austin Matthews. And I'm just trying to see if you can see it on here. It is numbered. It is right here. The number. So it's 121 of 199. So a green parallel. That's really cool. Of Austin Matthews too. And a Chris Chelios base. So I think that awesome Matthews, if I remember um, looking, I do have it open beside me here. I'm just kind of taking a look. Um, there's a couple glow shifts that, you know, Crosby's glow shift is worth quite a bit. Um, cast for greatness, McDavid, young or, uh, Elias Pettersson. So, yeah, there, there's definitely some some cool ones here. I don't see these are all, all autoed here for everything else. Elias Pettersson, or, um, serial numbered. Carter Hart, Austin Matthews. There is some ton of value to Austin Matthews card, but if it was the the autograph version, is what I'm trying to say. Sorry. 
All right. So Maxime Comtois, rookie. Is this a bounty one? Yep. So bounty. Uh, Isaac Lundstrom, number 11 of 799. 11 of 799. And then postseason perfection. Mark Messier, 1994 Stanley Cup playoffs. Messier's clutch performance helps end the Rangers' drought. There we go. That's pretty cool. Man, this is a cool product. Definitely cool product. And now that I'm opening up some, some more expensive hobby boxes, I mean, this synergy is still not your end-all, be-all. But just when you, you can kind of see the d difference in in quality between synergy and even MVP or or any of the other stuff I'm opening up, it's, it's quite exciting. Sorry, I'm having a hard time with this one. Um, it's quite exciting. So hopefully this continues and I'm able to keep adding up here on everything I'm doing. We have Dylan Gambrel, rookie, base. We have an exceptional talent, number 61 of 749 of Travis Dermott. And we have a base here of Alex Ovechkin. So an Alex Ovechkin base. All right, and the last pack of this case is... Take a look here. All right. We have a Michael Rasmussen, rookie for Detroit. We have a Ryan Donato, rookie. This one's 491 of 599. And we have a last line of defense. You're now Vancouver Canucks goalie, Braden Holpe. So there you have it, guys. Some pretty exciting stuff. I think the Austin Matthews card, if I had a guess, is going to be the most valuable card in this pack. Um, but I'm not too sure. I will post it up. Uh, I will. What I'm going to do is I'm going to open a one pack this break, and you'll see some more coming here. Um, Trying to make the videos a little shorter just so you guys don't get bored and lost in them. But there we have it. An awesome opening of a hobby box of Synergy 2018-2019. We got a few rookies, which are pretty exciting. We got an awesome Matthews significant selections out of 199. I'm I'm pretty stoked. This is this has been a very good box. I appreciate you very much for checking it out. Don't forget, by the time this comes up, we're still gonna have that contest going. I'm trying to get you guys some free stuff. So Upper Deck 2021 Series Two, there will be a team break. I'm gonna give away a free team as long as we get the minimum. So 50 comments. The comments have to say hashtag contest. You need to have your favorite player or team, and you need to have a you know leave a fun story about a hockey card or a hockey story for me, and we need to have at least 300 views. So let's get that going. Let's get you guys some free stuff, and I will see you guys in the next one.